Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest. I'm going to show the solution for the October 2014 Grade 3-4 Contest, Question 12, which also came up in the Grade 5-6 and 7-8 Contests. Alright, the question is... John loves spaghetti. He wonders how long a string of all the spaghetti on his plate would be if they were placed end-to-end -end in a straight line. At first, he measures the weight of the empty plate to be 420 grams. Then he puts cooked spaghetti on the plate with a total length of 5 meters, increasing the weight to 450 grams. After adding the whole portion of spaghetti that he wants to eat, the plate and spaghetti weighs 750 grams. Now what is the length of all spaghetti on his plate lined up? Alright, now our strategy for this question is to start from the end instead of the beginning and to see what we are given. Alright, the last sentence says that after adding the whole portion of spaghetti that he wants to eat, the plate and spaghetti weigh 750 grams. But now we want to find all the spaghetti. Alright, we know that the plate and the spaghetti weigh 750 grams. Alright, now we have to find a sentence that tells us the weight of the empty plate since we only want the weight of all the spaghetti. And in this sentence here it says he measures the weight of the empty plate to be 420 grams. So we will subtract that from 750. Okay, so 750 minus 420 is 330 grams. All right, now we have the mass of all the spaghetti. So now let's find a sentence that tells us the mass of a certain length of spaghetti. All right, and in this sentence, he says he puts the cooked spaghetti on the plate with a total length of five meters, increasing the weight to 450 grams from the 420 grams, which was just the empty plate. So to find the mass of the five meters of spaghetti, Okay, so we must subtract 420, which is the empty plate, from the 450, which has the 5 meters increased of the spaghetti. Okay, so we have 450 minus 420, which is 30 grams. Alright, so we know that 5 meters of spaghetti is 30 grams, but we want to find the length of all the spaghetti. So now we need to see how many times 30 grams goes into 330 grams, so that we can multiply that number by 5 and see what the length of all the spaghetti is. Okay, 330 can also be written as 300 plus 30, and 30 goes into 30 once, and 30 goes into 300, well, since there's that extra zero, must be 10 times. So it goes into 10 times and 1 time, so 10 plus 1 is 11, so therefore 30 goes into 330 11 times. So to find the length of all the spaghetti, we must multiply the 5 meters times 11.
and 5 times 11 is 55 meters. Therefore, we know that the length of all the spaghetti is 55 meters. Okay. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at caributest.com.